Hi. Today I want to check out something that really blew my mind. Quite a game changer, I think. Uh, it can actually transform the sound of a completely new greenback into the sound of uh, an original Pulsonic greenback. And it's basically free. Um, you know, the originals are extremely expensive from the late 60s and early 70s. Um, so the method is done in post. So when you record your tracks, you add EQ on them. So it's called EQ matching. So what you do is, is that you, uh, you record, um, say, riff 15 minutes, uh, and then you ask the software to, to, uh, to find out the average frequency distribution for, for those 15 minutes on that riff. And you do that for the original, the, the expensive vintage speaker. And then you put in the, the new speaker in the cab, and you record the average frequency distribution for that one. Uh, and save it. And then you have two frequency distributions, so, so basically two curves that you compare to each other. Then the software can calculate the, the, the kind of uh, vector between those two, the transformation. So it calculates a curve which makes the new greenback sound like the, the, uh, the old one. Uh, so it's available in Cubase, and I think there are many standalone apps as well. And the cool thing is you can, you can save it then as a CSV text file. I'm actually posting that in, in, the, uh, in the video description, so you can try it yourself. Let's try it now for three riffs. So first play the original, and record the, uh, the curve, and then the new one, record the curve, and then we're going to apply the curve on the new one, so you can hear it. Let's go. <laughs> So there we have the original and the, and the new one. Now, now uh, here you can see the white curve is the uh, new one and the green curve is the original. And you can see there's lots more uh, high frequencies in the new one. So, so therefore you have the, that dip in the orange curve there. And, and then you, you have to boost the lower mids in the orange curve to get the white one to look like the green one. So let, let's listen to the reference uh, uh, green back and, and, and the new one again, and, and then listen to the new one with this orange curve that will transform it into the old one, the reference one. Check it out. <laughs> I thought that was quite quite impressive. Uh, so, so here you can see also the to the right is, is the, the file. So, so it's just a, a, a table with the, all the frequencies and how much you boost or, or cut them. So, so you can use that uh, on your recordings. Uh, so, so it would be interesting to see, uh, is it possible to make these kinds of reference EQs that will be generally applicable? Or do you have to kind of calibrate it yourself? So there will be more clips on that. Now let's listen to it uh, for, 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 for two more riffs and we'll discuss it more at the end. Thank you. 
I, I think this is really useful. It came really close. Um, of course, when, when, you, uh, when you boost frequencies and cut frequencies, you, you, you lose some of the dynamics and the spatial definition. Um, but if you try to get as close as possible with the new signal chain, then, then the, uh, this EQ will be less dramatic. So you, maybe you can add, increase the, the clarity and dynamic range in, in, the, uh, in, the, uh, in the new one that way. Another thing that would be interesting to try is, is to uh, use outboard EQ with this curve in, in the FX loop of the amp when you play the new, the new greenback. Will it sound like this then? Or, or um, how, wh where should you apply this EQ in the, in the chain to, to get the best result? Uh, the coolest thing would be to have it sound like this in the room, of course, playing the new speakers. And, 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 and a third thought that, that, that occurs to me is, is that you could, you could do transfer curves between uh, 4x12, uh, 4x15, 1x15, 1x12, and so on, uh, using this. So I'm, I'm going to try that in, in coming clips. And as I said, I, I, I pasted the, uh, this uh, uh, file, the, the EQ file, in, in the uh, video description. So you can try it yourself, if you like. All right, let me know what you think in the comments. Cheers.